so these fools they want to take forever to upload these videos um because they're scary and uh they don't know how to take a L. and this isn't shit like this is barely just this is barely minuscule to me i know when I, if i find something big that like I'd be like, fuck, like, they'd probably fucking reset my phone or some shit like that, but this is, like, whatever, the same shit, but uh, they won't act like pussies about it either way, you know how they are, but, like, when I first, uh, because I was in the Leave Metro PCS, and uh, they, they, like, pretty much, like, went out of their way cut my bill in half and like because they knew that I was going to try to leave so they were trying to be like really generous um I only en ended up having to pay like 25 bucks for two phone lines that I owed for a whole month at the end of the month you have to pay so I only ended up paying like 25 and then I got an unlimited plan on another like added to another plan and uh And they let me stay with them. And then after I paid my bill, my internet speed has, like, dropped, like, really slow. And uh, I know they're doing it just to, like, frustrate you. But you can easily move to another company. Like, you don't have to stay with stay with them. You can easily move. And, uh, you know, they just want you to feel like you have to. Like, they, they want to feel like they're in control. When literally it doesn't really take much to... To like really like fucking expose these fucking names. The main thing you need to have is a, is a freaking uh, screen recorder because the thing is, is like you can't do anything if somebody else can't see. So if there's not somebody watching, so the screen recorder is pretty much like a person that's watching, confirming everything. But not only that, more than one person can see. So this is like kind of like a witness to <laughs> to their bullshit. But um. Yeah, you have to have a screen recorder, and I found that this one is pretty good. Um, the newer phones now, like the ones that you can't, that don't have a removable battery, like iPhones and stuff like that, um, they're probably a little bit harder, a little bit different. But you know, I have a kind of an older model phone that's it's not that old. It's probably like a year or two old, but I mean that's still high tech. Um, they've been you know advanced this stuff so good that it's. You know, it's pretty much all that they need, but um, it's pretty much all that they need, but um, what do you call it? Um, but a smart, uh, like a newer phone would be like a lot better for them to like collect information. Like, they're already doing enough, but I know these newer phones, why do you think they keep building like newer phones? They're, you don't think they're going to have more capabilities and stuff like that? For sure. Yeah. You want to get the phone as, as old as you can, like the oldest phone, a flip phone, no front camera, like those old freaking Nextel or phones or some shit like that. There's a, there's also, um, what's it called? Uh, I forgot what the name of the phone is, but there's four, like four phones that are like, uh, they're, they don't have like apps you can't install apps it's it's only call and texting and stuff like that I think it's called smartphone or something or not smartphone uh I forgot the name but it's on YouTube 
So they're obviously stalling this, but I mean, it's cool because I could upload this video too. And then I'll just confirm like that these fools are, you know, hating and shit. <laughs> that shit's funny to me, bro. Like they try to do the most to like, you know, when you leave your home, when you like when you get home, any any time of the day, any place, anywhere, they want to be like to try to make you feel a certain way. And when you and when it doesn't go their way, um, they they get really mad, but they try not to show it. And um, so that's why if you have shielding like for your head and you have, uh, you know, earplugs and stuff like that, anything that you alter from yourself, it they can pick it up. So if they are somehow connected to us, um, you know, they they use they rely a lot on technology and then, you know, the the signals and vibrations and frequencies and and, uh, you know, EMF waves and everything. They're they're being controlled and shit like they're just puppets. They're allowing themselves to be controlled. It's not that they're just they're forcefully, you know, robots. No, they know what they're doing and they're getting paid for it. And uh they don't want to question it because they don't want to go against the program. So. Like usually the, these videos will be super fast, but they're probably. Um, they're going to censor the shit out of this video. It's going to probably be the more information that you find that's critical. They'll probably get copyright strike me or something like that or some bullshit, but it doesn't really matter because I could just make another YouTube and I already have most of my stuff like backed up and shit. So, um, shit. And it's like, I have, I think, few people that are also like saving most of my videos. So, um, I can always get them back or I have I've, I save them to my playlist and I know they just don't delete your account right away. They just they'll, they'll give you some time so you can save all your shit or whatever. But um, all the videos that I upload are just information that I feel like can benefit somebody else. So that's why I post things, even if they're not from my channel. I don't take credit for them. I give you know, thanks and praise to the most high because, you know, he's reaching more than one person. If I seen it, it might be censored on somebody else's phone on their suggestions and they might not be, be able to see it and it can reach them or touch them a certain way that, you know, if they're subscribed to me, they might be able to see that video. So that's why I post a lot of stuff, a lot of different stuff that I feel that's inspiring or positive in any kind of way. Um, and they and they keep trying to like kind of linger this gang stalking thing with me along but i've been like i've crushed them so like so much that like they, it doesn't even there's no point to continue to try to gang stalk me like it's it's ne it's never gonna work but i mean they're not gonna see it but i don't really give a shit i'm just gonna keep exposing them and uh i'll probably install like a a decryptor file and a file manager that can see other files and stuff like that. So because if you stay ready, then um, it's going to be harder for them to like try to keep tabs on you and stuff. Like if you're constantly running scans and you have the, the apps that you need to pretty much run those scans, just like the one that I just installed, um, not, not just installed, but recently. Um, so yeah, I'm going to put the links to the, the apps that I feel that are good. I'm gonna try to remember because sometimes I forget, but I'm gonna put the, app, the apps that I feel like that can benefit and link to it. So that if you do have an Android, you can download this and tinker with your phone and just look at the files and you can just look at stuff. You don't have to turn anything off. Like, But it's a learning process. If you have a phone that you don't care if it gets messed up or whatever, then you know, do as much damage as you want. Um, but I, I've been I've been doing this for a, a while now, so I kind of know a little bit, not a, not enough, but um, I know enough to 
make these perps panties crumble so um yeah so just keep keep watching because I'll, I'll have some better content coming up if they keep thinking that they're smarter than me or something but whatever i mean god gives me my strength my wisdom and everything else so i ain't gotta worry about them trying to make me feel some kind of way or throw shade on me that shit failed they failed they are failures and they don't want to accept it so they're just gonna ride it till the wheels fall off